Hey, welcome back to ISS. I am very pleased to have Mark Temple with me from the University of Glasgow, who has just given a really great breakout session called Shifting Left to Elevate Service. Uh, and, and from what I understand, you really kind of delved into kind of how, how to unify lines of business uh, with Avanti's service management platform, right? What were your takeaways from your session? How did it go? Yeah, takeaways, you know, great crowd. Uh, they, they really enjoyed it. Um, key takeaways are focusing on common bonds. Don't, you know, a, a lot of lines of business try to keep everything separate, um, whereas when you're combined on one platform, um, you focus on what, what's common to you all. You know, we're all, I would have put it, you know, we're, we're all looking at who's dealing with it, who is the customer, where is it in its life cycle. These are all common and they all fit across all of these lines of business. And we all have common problems to, to solve. And a lot of what you focus on too is this idea of um, the wide areas where you've applied service management outside of IT. What are some examples of that? So HR, finance, um, accommodation, student support, campus security, uh, complaints handling, freedom of information, data protection. How long have you got? <laughs> I've got all the time in the world. It sounds like you've got a long list. Yeah, yeah, we've been busy. Yeah, uh, this idea of shifting left. Um, it's an interesting one because I know we've talked a lot about it here at ISS, but if you go up to anybody and ask them what does shifting left mean to you, and especially working with a university, it probably means something completely different. What does it mean to you, Mark? The knowledge, the answer they want when they want it, or the customer being able to have a, a request fulfilled automatically where possible when they want it fulfilled. Um, so that's the, the starting point for it, but also empowering our service desk to be able to run actions, get information that they would traditionally have had to escalate to third line, which all takes longer, the customer waits longer. Um, and, you know, in essence, the, the service desk is then chasing the third line, um, but not adding really any value to the, uh, to the transaction. Um, so if they can do all this at source, they're happier, the customer's happier, and, you know, it all gets done quicker. I imagine working for a university, uh, there's a different set of challenges when it comes to service management. And yeah, I understand the service manager is always a challenge no matter what business you're in, but talk about it from the university standpoint. You started talking about all those different lines of contact that you have. Uh, how do you approach service management at the University of Glasgow? Yeah, so I'd say we, we, you know, we're a diverse group. Um, we've got a very large internal audience. Uh, we are. 35,000 plus students, 10,000 plus staff. Um, so there's a lot of people with you know, different points of view, different ways of doing things, or, or did have different ways of doing things, but we're, we're trying to get them to, together. Um, but it's, you know, there isn't a one size fits all, I think is the, is the reality. You have to be sympathetic to that. Um, but we've learned that you know, by focusing on the common bonds between us, um, it brings all of these, and some, I'm not quite sure, warring factions together, but all of these, you know, people who have you know, different priorities, different ways of doing things, bringing them together, um, you know, on one, basically on one platform as a, as a start. But once they're on one platform, it's then easier for them to learn from each other. So what works well in one area, you know, we, we can inject into another area. And that's, that's not just the tooling, that's just, you know, it can be best practice, it can be an approach to reporting, to shared KPIs, measurements, whatever. Um, so, you know, see, we're, we're a, a diverse group. Um, it's, it's a big, big organisation. Um, so that, you know, brings a lot of challenges with it. But, you know, we're, we're getting there. It, Rome wasn't built in a day. You know, it's, it's not a, it's a job for life, I think is, um, famous last words, maybe. Yeah, right. And, and those challenges never stop, do they? They're, they're always evolving. Uh, like you mentioned, you have a very unique set of challenges. Do you feel uh, that you're getting some of those questions answered here at ISS? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the great value in, you know, talking to your peers, um, but also getting the, the time with Avanti staff, um, getting a deep dive into the, you know, the solutions and, and say just... You know, I've had a couple of problems that I've brought, brought with me. In fact, a couple of things that have cropped up while we were here, and it's great to get someone's ear five minutes of their time and been able to, you know, how would you, how would you approach this? Got an answer, fed it back, we're, we're good. So, you know, 
this is you know, as much the interaction with the peers as you know pays for the ticket. You know. Well, I hope those conversations continue for you. Have a great ISS. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Thanks. This is uh, Mark Temple from the University of Glasgow here at ISS. Again, thanks for your time.